Hi there, and welcome to everything you need to know about 3ds Max 2025. Discover top highlights in 3ds Max from open technologies like OpenColor IO and OpenUSD to modeling and rendering. Starting with color management, OpenColor IO is now the default mode for color management in new scenes making it easier than ever to implement a modern color pipeline. The Vertex Paint tool is now color managed. The new color space conversion process operator can be applied to data channel modifiers, allowing you to convert color data from one rendering space to another. The Bake to Texture tool allows you to select color space for output files and more. You can continue working more seamlessly across animation workflows with OpenUSD. This update enables you to import animations such as animated light and camera and blend shape and enjoy additional functionality when using the material switcher to accommodate the use of multi sub object materials when exporting a USD file. Model with speed using updated retopology tools. Pre-processing is now available as a standalone option from the algorithm menu options. When in use, it will only perform the pre-process step, giving you a triangulated output result. OpenVDB remeshing is also available from the algorithm menu options. This allows you to remesh your selected data using OpenVDB's volume to mesh conversion, which reconstructs watertight geometry using sign distant fields grids and render in a flash with an overhaul GPU renderer in Arnold, bringing multiple improvements in startup time, rendering time, and lower GPU memory usage. Global light sampling is now also supported in volumes, which means even scenes with only a few lights are faster to render. You can also now work in a sleek interface with a modernized and expanded global search function, giving you a more thorough list of tools, function, commands, and settings at your fingertips. Customize your workspace with a new menu editor, allowing you to easily customize 3ds Max menus and quad menus. To see the full list of new features and improvements, you can check out our What's New in 3ds Max page linked in the description. And for more videos like these, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.